What is up, guys, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we are going to continue our playthrough of Power World. So the last time that we played this game, it was on stream. So I don't remember too much of what happened. I know we created a new base in a pretty high area that we needed to get to uh, with chests and stuff like that. So, um, you know, that's a good news. But in order for me to complete the playthrough, I want to beat all the trainers. I want to try to catch all the pals that we can and just kind of progress within the game. So that is what we are going to do here and obviously moving forward in our episodes. So as always, if you guys do enjoy the video, make sure to leave a thumbs up. Also hit that subscribe button if you are new. As like I said, we will continue our playthrough of Power World until we completely finish this game and we will uh, we'll see what happens. So kick back, relax, and enjoy the video. All right, all right, all right, all right. So we're level 31, 31. So let's jump in again. I have not played this game in probably weeks because uh Baldur's Gate has taken up my time completely and that has been the game of my choice for a hot minute um so we are checking out Pal World once again it's been a minute but yeah so we are on the um show you guys the map here we are up by the cold shore um I know there's going to be another base that I'm going to build here for coal uh, once we get to that level of once we start going through coal, but um, I do want to try to catch all of these bosses too. That's also another thing that I want to do. I want to go through and try to catch everything with the bosses as well. Um, so we have 204 pal spheres, 11 mega spheres, 8 gigasphere, and 1 hypersphere. We do have a musket. I don't think we have the assault rifle yet. Um, we do have weapon workbench, production assembly line. We need to build a weapon assembly line. Let's see where we're at, where, uh, where we are at in the tech tree. I don't really know. Okay, so we're almost, we're close to doing the weapon assembly line, which is good. Um, I don't think we're going to need the gates because we don't get any raids up here from what I remember. So we should be in the clear there. Um, where is the assault rifle? Yeah, so the single shot rifle is there and then pump action shotgun. Okay, so we want the single shot rifle. That'll be 36. So we definitely have some time to figure things out so um we do have a two we did breed an anubi we have an anubis a robin quill okay let's see where we're at with materials and stuff like that too um okay so we definitely have a lot of ingots do we have another base did i build another no we didn't build okay so we need to build all right so that's what we need to do we need to build our iron deposit. Um, we do not have iron deposits going right now, and we need to go do that. We need to go get some dig toises. We do have a reptirio, another reptirio, so that's good. I actually forgot how to breed the reptiros, actually. But I know that'd be really easy. We could use these, uh, these dumids. Dumids? Dumids. Um, so we could go do that as well. Okay, so we... We have one base right now, right? One base. We got rid of the one that was down here. Okay, we had a base that was down here for a little bit. Or was like... Where was it? I think it was right here on the other iron deposits that we had. So let me go to... This is where we want to go. Because there's iron and there's coal here. And actually up here, I think, is... Um, there's another material that we're not going to need right away. Okay, so uh, how many materials do we need to build a pell box? We need... One pallium fragment. We need eight wood and three stone. Um, so we need eight wood. From 20. 20 stone, just in case. We do, do we have pallium? I think we only need, no, we need pallium, pallium, pallium. But we need to make more pallium. Um, that is what we definitely need to do. Okay, I do have the handgun. I forgot that I have the handgun. Let's try to get uh, Pallium going here before anything. Oh, we do have a lot. Okay, 74. Oh, we got plenty. Okay. I mean, we don't have plenty, but we definitely have a good amount. We have so much stone as well, dude. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay. All right, let's fast travel. Um, we have our Van Worm. Let's fast travel to the other base. I want to build our second base here before we forget about it. I want to go on top of the mountain and start getting our iron deposit and our coal deposit. Um, that is key. Which I think... Um, where is it in regards to this? Okay, I think it's up there. 
Is it this way? I think it's this way. Nope, it's this way. I think that up there is where we need to go. There's an effigy here too. Um, for those of you guys that do not know as well, I did change the egg hatching. Um, I changed the egg hatching to like instant in this uh, in this playthrough because I didn't want to wait, you know, 50 million hours for my eggs to hatch. So some might call it cheating, but that's the only thing that I did. That's the only thing that I did end up changing in this playthrough. Um, I just didn't want to wait, man. I, I was so impatient. I was so freaking impatient. Uh, it's up here. That's where it is. I mean, I know we have a marker on it, but I know the rock when I see it, bro. And my other playthroughs, this is usually my second base too. I hate when they try to attack me when I'm on a bird. Because it's not as easy to get away from these guys as, say, if I was on the ground. Um, try to get here to regain stamina. Okay, we're good. Alright. Um, I know there's also, like, wood up here. So the biggest thing that we're going to need for sure is stone and pallium. We definitely need to make sure that we get enough, like, food and things as well. It's like we have a friend up here. We could try to catch this friend. Yeah. I don't know if it's going to do... If it's going to kill it, though. That's the only thing. Nope. That's actually perfect. That is perfect. I'm assuming we're going to need to catch more of these anyways. Oh my god, it's moving super fast. I want to use these freaking pal spheres, but I think it's going to be impossible with it being a level 22. There's no way. Am I going to kill it? Oh, it's going to... Okay. I was not expecting that. Right. Well, I just want to get this thing done. There we go. Oh, I don't have one of those. Oh, why did I think that I had? I swear I had them. Wait, where did the stone go? Did I not? Are you kidding me? Did I not have stone? Oh my goodness. I'm so, I swear I brought up stone. Did I drop it? I must have freaking dropped it, dude. That's so annoying. All right, well, let's uh, let's go get stone then, I guess. Oh, there's a chest right here. Uh, there's pallium right there, so we can get some pallium right there. Easy peasy. Is there any stone that's around? I don't see any stone. That's the only problem is, of course, we need eight stone. It's the one thing that sucks about this area. As it does not have any stone. Oh, there's a chest like half in, half out. This water kind of looks scary, not gonna lie. Medical supplies. Alright, let's see if we can go get ourselves some stone here. We gotta find it first. Let's see if we can find it. I'm assuming there's probably gonna be some down here. There's a tree. Uh, I think that's stone right there that we can that we can get. That's so annoying, dude. I swear I got. I swear I I brought stone with me. Oh. Yep. There we go. We're good. All right. Let me get this egg too. Never know what's gonna be in the eggs now. Is that stone? Yeah, it's stone. We're good. All right. We just need eight, but I'm gonna get as much as we can. Might as well, just in case. Doesn't make sense not to. Oh, we're getting ore from this. How did I not know that we got ore from this, too? That's good to know. All right, hold on. Give me two seconds, guys. I need to turn off my mouse without borders thing because it keeps on getting caught up on the top of my other on my streaming PC. All right. All right, let's climb the mountain again. And let's place our second base so we can start getting some iron down. Or start crushing through some iron. I mean, we've got enough, but I also want to get some coal and stuff like that, too, so. But as we continue to uh, level up and as we continue to, like, level up our bases and stuff like that, 
the more coal and iron is going to be like a necessity. Why can I think of the other material that we need? It's over on that other base that I have scheduled. I don't know where that other base... Okay. All right. Where the hell did you guys come from? Okay. All right. You guys just happen to spawn up here, huh? Does my mammoths want to do anything? Or is it just going to just sit there? There you go. There you go. Much better. All right, it's dead. Oh, did you? I actually got some coal from that. Once I, once he did the look. Okay, hello. Interesting. Okay, dude. Enough. Mamorest. Thank you. All right, I think we're good. Okay, so we need to build a pal deck here. Where do we want to? Um, I'm assuming let's do some foundation here, I think, too. Let's build a foundation. I think that makes the most sense here. And we can put the, like the pal box on top of it, probably. I just want to make sure that we get all of the... Oh, can we not build on the foundation? Oh, okay. Never mind. We can't build on the foundation then. So we can build it like right here. I mean, that kind of that that kind of works, doesn't it? I think that works. All right, let's see where it has us go, though. Yeah. Huh. Like, is it on the edge? Okay, it's right on the edge of these trees. I just want to make sure that it gets it, it gets everything. It's not pushing us off the mountain too. Which I don't think it's pushing us off the mountain. So that's actually like the prime spot. And there's a little bit, there's a little bit of a cutoff here. Um, yeah, I mean, I think we'll be okay. I don't think anything's going to fall off. So we should be in a, I, I think we'll be in a clear here. I think we'll be in a clear. All right, let's build this real quick. Anubis got that done instantly cool all right because then when we spawn in we can put some chests up here too we definitely need to get um now we can spawn back and forth though berry plantation so we need berry seeds and uh wheat and we need okay so we need a bunch of things so let's do can we build a metal chest okay we need 15 15 ingot and 30 wood so let's build a metal chest so we can continue to go back and forth and like start bringing some things back so let's do, let's just get a bunch of wood, um, get a bunch of ingots and bring that with us too. So we have it just so we have it and we're good to go. Berry seeds. Where are the berry seeds at? Are they in here? Okay. Perfect. We do have berry seeds. Uh, we do have wheat seeds. So let's bring the wheat seeds and let's go back to our base. Let's build a metal chest. That's right next to. Um, probably going to be annoying that we're going to have to walk a little bit here, but it's not terrible. I think we'll live. It, it, we're right next to it. So usually I like to build it like super close, but th this should be okay. Yeah. Yeah. Just wasted a mega sphere on that. Nice. All right. So let's put all of this stuff in here that we are going to keep here at this base. Okay, so we have the metal chest, so that's good. Um, we're... Okay, so we could build both the berry. Okay, so let's probably go... I want to use the flatland for sure. Um, let's build the wheat plantation first. Um, wait, can we build this on wood? Oh, we can build this on wood. Oh, interesting. Maybe we... Maybe we get a little creative here. This actually might make sense. Not place on the ground. What do you mean? Okay, this one does not want to go out, I guess. Not place on the ground either. Okay. 
We definitely want to make sure that we keep enough room for the coal that's under here. Um, can we put some a ramp here? We can. Very nice. Not connected to a structure. We put up a wall, maybe. Our foundation. Okay, I mean, that kind of works. A little janky, but it'll get the job done, I guess. Um... Yeah, I mean, it gets the job done, I guess. It doesn't say it's connected to a structure, but it'll work. Okay. Well, these, tree these trees are going to regrow in this, isn't it? That's the only annoying part about this, is that these trees are going to regrow. I just want to make sure there's enough room for the coal. But this is a good kind of... I, I think this is going to be a good idea. This, this foundation, personally. I just want to make sure it's all... Okay, it's all the right way. It sucks that we can't, like... Oh, man, that's that's annoying. That's really annoying. Okay, but we can at least build up here, so it'll actually be kind of good. All right, so there's enough. Can he hit that? Okay, he can hit that. That's good. Perfect. All right, let's get some stairs here. Um... Yeah, it's really annoying that that's not working, but let's try this. And then let's do... How much wood do we get? Okay, that's perfect, actually. That'll, that's perfect. Okay, so this is our, our foundation. I'm not going to build a house or anything here. It makes no, it makes no sense to me. We could put, can we put a roof here maybe? No, it needs a structure. That's so frustrating, man. That's so freaking frustrating, dude. That I can't build there and it won't touch the ground. That's annoying. Like, really? It's not going to do anything. Mm-hmm. You used to be able to, like, like, raise it, you know? But apparently you can only raise it so far. Okay, so let's do um, the wheat plantation. Where do we want to put the beds? That's actually a really good point. Where do we want to put the beds? We could put them on the edge. Um, there's not a lot of space to... I mean, we could put them over here. Do some more foundation work over here. Yeah, I mean, this could work. I mean, we got another tree in our way. That's the only thing that kind of sucks. Again, I don't know if it's going to grow back. It might grow back into it, so that'd be a, that'll be a problem. But, yeah, I mean, we could put the beds here. That, that'll that work, I think. Foundation here. Want to make sure that we can get enough coal, though. That's the only thing. Holy crap. We want to make sure that they can still uh, do what they need to do there. We probably could have lifted it up a little bit, actually, now that I think about it. And had to go underneath, but that's okay. All right, let's drop all this that we don't need. Drop all this. Okay, so we definitely need plantations. So let's do... Let's get our plantation stuff done here. Let's do a wheat plantation. Um, we could do... Hmm, the berry plantation makes sense to be on this little ledge here. I think I'll, I, I think they'll be able to still plant everything here, I believe. Um, and then let's do, we need more stone. Okay, let's, let's fast travel back and get more stone. We just need to get a butt, we just need to get a butt ton of stone. That, that's what we need to do. Just take a butt ton of the stone that I have here. 
which is where do I not have any stone left is all my stone up here all my stone is up here I wish that just because uh they had like storage up here that it would go yeah like just because I had storage up here I wish it would go down to my other um storage unit you know by the way, if you guys ever need the grappling or if you guys ever need to try to figure out how to get from point A to point B when you're uh, over cumbered or whatever it's called, grapple hook is your friend. Trust me. The thing is such a great tool. Okay. Um, let's get the Anubis out here. You can start mining and things like that too, which will be good. All right, drop all that. All right, so we need another berry plantation here. Wish I could see. We could probably put... Oh, that's a, that's a ramp, isn't it? Mm. That's a ramp. Shoot. Uh, where's my torch? Okay, so... Do we want to build a stairwell that's going to go off of this, maybe? Could do that instead. Foundation. Yeah, maybe we do this, and then maybe we remove this. Because then we can add the berry plantation there. And then... Yeah, see, the trees came back. Hmm. That's going to be kind of annoying. But that should give enough room there. And then there's a coal deposit there, too. Okay, I think we're going to actually delete this. Let's delete these. I don't need these. Um, let's do the stairs here. I don't think I can't remember where the coal deposits are. I can't remember if there's one right here or not. Is there one right here? Uh, I can't remember if there is one there. But we definitely need to do okay, we need wood. That that's easy. Um wood, 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 wood. We just need to get we we need to make sure that this is self-sufficient before we start throwing down a bunch of pals that's the only thing to make sure we got beds need to make sure that we can just need to make sure we can feed everybody dude having an anubis on you is so clutch it is so freaking clutch all right, so we need to make some beds here. So let's make some beds over here. We probably are going to need fiber. That's the only thing. Could do more nails too. All right, let's get a bunch of beds down for everybody. Um, I don't know if the tree is going to be blocking this. That's the only thing. It doesn't look like it. So that's good. I want a 369 here. All right, we need more wood. Definitely have it. No, I didn't want to do that. It broke that down. That's so annoying. Shoot. And it's uneven. That's going to bug me. All right, we need foundation. That way? It's that way. Okay. Um, all right, we need to delete that. I feel like I'm trying way too hard for this. But it's okay. Um, put our next 369. We actually could probably get four beds here. We could probably get four beds here. Like in each row. Yeah, we could definitely get four. Oh, that's nice. Okay, let's just keep on rolling with these. Just keep on getting them down. 
so we can start getting the pals there. The only thing with the Reptiro that sucks is we need the large pal bend to make sure that he gets his, he continues with its sanity. That's the only problem. We also don't have the the big um, hot springs, which also um, is not good. We need the larger hot springs. All right, but we got seven beds, so that's good. Once we hit 10, then we can start. I think we can start getting everybody out here. Need three more. I wanted to build this big enough because I want to get the large pal beds on. I want to get all the beds here and the food here. So if I can get the, pal the large pal beds here and then the also the, the high quality springs, which you might not be able to do right here. But I think it might work. Okay. So now let's start to put some pals out here. So we need um, water and planting. So we can definitely put the dino out here for planting. Um, the Azurobe for the watering. Transporting. That's actually pretty clutch for that. We can have kindling here, which will be good there. Um, transporting level three and gathering. Okay, so we definitely want your gathering and cooling. Do we have any like planting? Watering is level two. Watering is level three. So okay, so we want you. We want you. Um, we want you. Lumbering, level three transporting for sure. Drop you out there, drop you, drop you. We could add our Tombats as well, which could be clutch. I need to get the freaking. oh my God, we have so many pals, dude. So many of the same pals, it's insane. Uh, you are planting, so let's get the Cinemoth for sure for planting. Um, kindling and lumbering, watering. Gathering level two. Um, let's have you out there. Okay, we also have. I mean, we also can add some tombats. So let's let's add some tombats while we have them. Might as well. Makes the most sense. All right, then this is gonna be quite self-sufficient here. All right, let's get some fiber. We definitely need to get some fiber here. We need to build two more beds. We're going to have to keep an eye on that Reptiro just in case because its sanity is going to drop like crazy. We also need to make... We need Pal Fluids bad. Make sure that we get the, the hot springs going. Okay. So let's make sure we get some um, Pal Fluids as well. All right, let's go get Pal Fluids. I don't think we need uh, anything here right now. Let's just grab 25 just to be safe. Make sure this is self-sufficient. And then we'll be good to go. I mean, we need wood. It is quite annoying that that is there, but that's okay. All right, let's add the hot spring there. You have gathers, which is good. Transporters, you are planting. Is that growth as well? That's growth back there too. Okay, so we are, we need a food box. Oopsies. Need a food box for sure. Forgot about that one. Okay, yeah, that's that's big with the transporting. Um, That's gonna be really annoying. go food box let's put it out here for let's mm, i don't know where to put it uh let's put it over here for now okay we also need a furnace need to make sure we get a furnace here 
All right, they're gathering, so that's good. Okay, we're going to get berries in no time there. Let's drop the coal, fiber, power fluids. Don't need any of that stuff right now. Okay. Um, yeah, trying to figure out where the coal deposits are going to be is the annoying part. I mean, that they could kind of just go right through there, so that's good. Yeah, we need these to... We need to drop these berries in here like ASAP. That Reptero is going to be hungry. All right, I think I'm going to add another berry plantation just to be safe. Four berries, the better. I know it's not the best food, but at least right now until we can get um, tomatoes and stuff, I think it's going to be the way to go. Yeah, let's put down another one here just to be safe. Cool. All right. So they're gathering. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. That's there. So that's good. Um, can we put down a furnace, possibly? We need flame organs and wood. So let's go back. Do we have any more flame organs? I'm assuming we do. Oh, we got plenty, dude. We got plenty. All right, drop this down. Let's get the furnace going because then we can start just crushing out refined everything okay i think everything looks good everything looks good right now so we're we're in the clear that is good um let's put the furnace like here maybe That probably makes yes. sense. And then we got a bunch. Yeah, okay. So we can do charcoal, but we don't have refined ingots yet. All right, you're going after the iron. We got level three transporting, which I think is clutch. Probably should have moved this over. But okay. So now we have a self-sufficient base though, so that's good. That's all we need. I'm just gonna build. I'm, fuck it, dude. I'm just gonna build stairs here. So we can go up. Screw it. Okay. All right. So we're getting the ingots. They're transporting. He's mining. All the coal, so that's good. His that the sanity for freaking the Reptero is dropping hella quick. Oh my goodness. That's the only thing that sucks about these things, man. They're so good. They're like the best. Oh, it's actually in the pool. Oh wait, it can go in the pool? I didn't know that they fit in these smaller pools. That is actually really good to know. Okay. We got a bunch of wood and everything here too, which will actually be nice too when we need to continue to build things. But that's pretty much gonna be it. I mean, that's pretty much all that this is. So we're we're in the clear for what we needed to do here. Well, 38, what level am I? The 31. Okay, so let's see what we can do in the meantime. So we're level 31. These are level 31s out here. So these are pretty much the prime level. Um. You're 38. Like, Grintel's level 17. I mean, technically speaking, we can clear out. We can get the King Paka. We can get the Bushi. Uh, we can clear out all of these. Broncheri. Lunaris might be a little bit difficult. But let's go kill this King Paka. We also need to get the... We need to get a Fanglobe, dude. Which I think is right up here somewhere. The Fanglobe is really, really good of a, as a super fast mount. Um, that gets me from point A to point B like it's nobody's business. So that's that's one that I think we need to go to and we need to get, which I believe is somewhere over here. Because the Jormantide is here. I believe it's up here. So let's, let's fast travel while well, this is all self-sufficient. All right, let's see what we can find up here. We also just go egg hunting, dude. There's just... I, I get so many eggs now, it's actually insane. 
Van Worm is really, really slow, but it gets the job done whenever it needs to get, you know, whenever it needs to be done. I don't know if I've actually caught these. Have I caught these? I think I have. I don't know if I've caught, I don't know if I need any more of you. About to find out though. Ow. 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 They don't have the mobility when I'm on this thing. Dude, Mega Spheres are just the way to go now. Pal Spheres are just a joke. Okay, I need a couple more of you actually. Give me that XP. Probably can hit it one more time. Go. It's hurt my, it's hit my armor though. Oh, there's an effigy over there. Dude, it's got 20. I mean, god dang it, dude. That's so annoying. Okay, there's more over here. Give me that XP, baby. Level 14 for those guys. More arrows. Oh, they're pissed off now. I definitely pissed off everybody now. Ow. Get off the wall. Woo. That's it. Dude, they move at the last second. That's so annoying. Stop moving. All right, we need two more. Two more and we get that XP bonus. And we just leveled up, which is good. I think, do I have the pistol? Do I have a pistol? I do. How many bullets do I have for it though? 13. Oh, I got to sneeze. All right, we're good. Sorry about that. Damn, the other one just left him, huh? Or her? Bro, these things hurt. I didn't think. One more, right? One more. Also, if you guys ever want to know how the fastest way to, to level up in Pal World, if you haven't figured it out yet, by catching pals. Literally the, the fastest way of leveling up in this game. People don't seem to kind of understand that when they first start playing, like how to, how to level up. And then once you get like 10 of the pals, then you get them, you get a, an XP bonus with the 10, with the 10 pals that you catch the same one. And it, dude, the XP is so freaking nice. Probably get these Relaxasauruses too while we're here. I feel like I want to come back. I don't want to really try to catch too many pals until we have that rifle. Dude, the rifle makes things so much easier, man. All right, I feel like I'm so slow. Give me my dire wolf, please. Uh, I think I actually need more of you. Only a level 10 too, which is, oh my God, I missed. How do I miss that? Oh, he's running. He's getting ready to charge. Oh, heck yeah. Level 13? Uh oh. Did I trigger them? Oh boy. Okay, they're not, I'm not fighting those guys though. They're fighting something else and they have a big flamethrower. Ow. Okay, that was a big hit. That was a big critical hit right there. Bro, they are chasing something. What are y'all chasing up there, man? Okay, I guess uh, we could probably just do some pal hunting then. Need a silver key. These guys are all like super low level. The pistol would be really, would be so much nicer, but. What, where did that, okay. I need mega spheres though. Doing this with regular pal spheres is not gonna work. It's just, it's not gonna do it. 
The regular pals, I mean, okay, we got away with that one, but I feel like the regular pal spears are just, they're not going to cut it, man. I'm really trying to avoid all of these, all these dudes over here that went running up here, but I want to get to this univolt too. I don't see any others. I feel like they'd be together in a pack. Oh, I missed. Oh, I missed. That's not good. No, that's not what I wanted to do. There's another one up here, though. Yeah, I definitely think we're getting into the territory where the um, Fanglope is. Oh, they were they were together. They were just split up because of the terrain. I pissed them up. I can't move. Dude, it's actually insane. Once you get to level 30, like how slow you actually, it takes to like level up. It's actually kind of nuts. 6%. 10% catch rate. We're going to be here for a minute. I think that bronze cherry is stuck. Let's take advantage. If that thing is stuck, then we might be able to catch it. See if it's stuck. Oh, it's not stuck. Okay, it's not stuck. Lesson learned. Lesson learned. It's definitely not stuck. And it is a beefy. Ow. How do I miss that? Bro, mm, that's the only thing about being on mounts in this game. You don't really have a lot of room to dodge. I actually don't know. Can we craft Gigaspheres yet? I think we can craft Gigaspheres, so we should be in the clear to just use that Gigasphere. All right, let's see if we can find this Fanglope. I need to figure out where this Fanglope uh, boss is. I know it's, it's in a waterfall somewhere. I just got to find said waterfall. This place is littered with freaking syndicate people. I believe it's right around here, the waterfall. It's got to be. Um, okay, there's a fast shovel here. Where's the fast shovel? There's an egg up here. Ooh, we want that mega sphere for sure. I guess I do those guys. Okay, they don't jump on to me. Well, if I need freaking R soxes, there's so many of them here. Holy crap, dude. All right, we're looking for a waterfall. I was about to call everybody chat because I'm so used to streaming this game. It's got to be around here somewhere, dude. It has to be. Over here to the right, maybe? Oh, they do? Okay, so they are aggressive. I, I didn't know they were passive or not. Oh, I know where we are. The dig toy, there's dig toys up here, which we actually probably should go get some dig toys. Now that I think about it. Yeah, I know where we are. I know where we are. But that doesn't solve the problem that I'm looking for the fanglope, which I don't believe the fanglope is anywhere around here. So where is the fanglope? It, it must be right here. Must be in this area. Because we're going to get to like the Scorching Sands area up here to the right. It's a Quivern, which is only a level 23. So we technically we could probably just destroy that thing right now if we wanted to. Not going to right now though. We don't need to do it right now. So the Jormantide is like right down here. Um, I'm making it my goal to find, figure out where this damn, figure out where this, uh, freaking Fanglope is. I mean, we could probably just breed one, to be honest with you. I need to look at breeding guys. I don't remember 
It's been a while since I played this game, so I don't remember what the breeding guides, like what it takes to breed for a fanglo. But I mean, we're definitely a high enough level that we can just catch. We can just catch the boss and make the boss our, our mount. Personally, until we get uh, Shadow Beak. I think Shadow Beak is the one that everybody says that's insanely good. Fly away. There's so many camps, dude. Wait, there's a fast travel here. Hold on. We need to get the fast travel. We pissed everybody off, but we need to get the fast travel. Fast travels are key. Don't have to worry about doing this later. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know what we can build with the tech points that we have. We got to check. All right, I'm getting impatient. So much faster. So much faster. Okay, we are getting into some scary territory here that we probably should not be in. I think if I'm not mistaken, the boss is right here. Oh. Sulfur. That's for gunpowder. It's not what we need, though. There was something else. Yeah, Jormantide is definitely right down here, for sure. There's no way. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, we definitely don't want to be here. We don't want to piss him off. He's a level 45, and that is not ideal. He's badass, though. Look at him. So freaking sick. He's out of the water. Made it out of the water. Okay, so I'm trying to think, like, water... I'm trying to be smart here. So there's water here. Is there a waterfall that's anywhere near it or no? Like, god dang, man. Ah, we have ammo for our musket now, so that is good. Um, it's got to be up here. It has to be up here. On the other side of this rock. I just can't see where else. I, I just can't see where else it would be. Because I know the Fenglo, I definitely, like, we're at a level now that we could we could definitely kill it. Or capture it, excuse me. Go get that egg, too, so we can hatch the egg real quick and see. What we can get, I think, what is it called? A verdant egg? Looks like it's a large one. I don't think there's, I don't know if there's actually large eggs of those. Gotta be here, man. Gotta be here. If not, I'm gonna go crazy. Oh, there's another effigy down there. Son of a gun, dude. It, the thing with the effigies, which is so annoying, bro, you get one and then you try to fly away and then there's like multiple ones. It's like, oh, you want you want to fly away even though there's another effigy here? It's like, dude, really? Um, okay. Definitely not here, but at least the fast travel. So we can hit the fast travel though. Yeah, it's not here. Bang of opens. Dang it, man. Where is this thing? Where are you? Where are you? All right, we're traveling up here. I'm determined to get this freaking thing. I am determined to get this pal before we end this episode. That's a fact. It's happening. I have a feeling we're close. I think it's over the crest of this hill, the waterfall we're looking for. It's in such a weird spot, too. Oh, I hear a shiny. It'd be really, really nice to have a shiny Cinemoth. Really, really nice to have. It's not here, dude. Son of a bitch. <laughs> dude, I freaking... I can't win. 
You know what's gonna be you know what's annoying is I'm going to look it up online after I'm done like with this episode. And it's gonna be like one of those moments where it's like, you've gotta be kidding me. That's where it is. That's where it was. That's what's gonna happen. Maybe it's somewhere down here. Maybe it's somewhere down there. Hmm. Mm, I don't think it's this far. Yeah. Are those scorching sands? Okay, those. Those are the scorching sands. Those are not going to be fun. Those are definitely not it. All right. What are we at? About 50 minutes in. All right. Let's go. Let's go back to our base. Let's find a. Let's get to the fast travel up here. Let's go back to our base. We'll find the Fang Lobe next episode once I look up online where it's at again because I can't remember where it's at. It's been a while since I played. We'll hatch the eggs real quick, see what we can hatch. Turn in the effigies. I don't know if we actually... I don't know if we have enough to level up with the uh, effigy, but I guess we'll find out, huh? I guess we'll find out. That shovel, I think, is way up top. Yeah, I think it's up top more. All right. Gather my stamina here. Such a slow bird, dude. The flying is so slow until you get to the last bot or the last um, flying pal. All right. And the stamina is also, like... At least, it at least it restores quick, which is good, like the stamina wise. But still, it's just so annoying. I understand why they didn't want to have the, like, have you have a flying pal super early. I totally get that, but it's still annoying. <laughs> all right, let's go back to the base, um, which is all the way up here. Let's turn in these eggs. Um, where is our incubator? Here we go. All right, let's see what we get. Oh, we got a Bushi. Ah, that's actually really clutch. We need him. He's good to have on base, I think. Okay. Very nice. Uh, Caperty, I think we already have one. Is there another egg? Yeah, we got multiple Caperties already. Another egg here. Let's, let's do the egg right now while we got it. And a uh, rookery, right? Okay. Where are all my pals? Does anybody know where? Where's all my pals at? Hello? Are they sleeping? Am I missing something? In good condition, it seems hungry. I don't know where my pals are. I think they're glitched. I think all my pals are glitched right now. Okay, that's good. That's interesting. That's good to know. Yeah, dude, everybody was hungry. Bro, everybody was hungry. What the fudge? Where was everybody at? Okay. Okay. That's not good. Um, all right. Uh, what did I need to do here? We have a enhancement. I'm going to go up with the health. Um, we have another level that we can get. So we do have the high quality hot springs. I should have actually, I should put that. Hmm. I should put that. Uh, yeah, we need to kill some more of these bosses so we can get these technology things. Okay, where is... So we need to do electricity. Do we have an electric pal that's here? Oh, we need an electric pal. And we just threw that beacon back there. Hmm. The beacon, I think, has level 3 electricity. Yeah, we want the Bushi in here for something. Gathering, kindling, handiwork, lumbering at 3, transporting at 2. 
Um, he'd be a good one to have. Lumbering at three, transporting at three. Maybe the Robin Quill? Yeah, let's, uh, let's have the Robin, let's have the Bushi in for the Robin Quill. Um, we need electricity. That's for the flame organs. We need... How much wool do we have? Do we have enough wool? We have 249. Okay, we need to go get... We need to bring Beacon back. We need to bring Beacon back for sure. Let's have you go in here. Transporting is at two. I mean, the transporting three is really nice, but let's put the Robin Quill here instead. I mean, we could put in a Van Worm. Actually, let's do that. Let's do... Need another bed, though. Probably need another bed. Okay, let's send the beacon back. Um, let's build the electricity real quick. See, here's the problem with Pal World is you build it. All right, it's just like you want to continue. You want to continue to play. Okay, we, we could probably put the electricity here. And then the, the assembly lines we could put right next to it too. But we could get another spot actually once we do this. Now that I think about it. I didn't realize that we could build a high quality hot springs. So the next episode, I definitely want to build a high quality hot springs um, on the other base for sure. All right, so we have enough room that we can start building these out. So we need we need high quality oil production assembly line though. Let's do this. We need high quality gun oil. Where do we get the oil from? Hmm? To figure out where we get the oil from. So this, we could do all the production stuff. So that'll be good. Uh, then there is a, we probably should have actually made some more room here. We could probably move this. Yeah, and we'll just have the three production lines here. So this is the production assembly. And there's a sphere, uh, there's a sphere one, I think. Yeah, there's a weapon assembly line, sphere one. So we can put all three here, so that'll be good. It'll be out of the way for us. I mean, we have all this space to do whatever we need to do, so... Not really too concerned. Okay, well, let's save. Um, actually, I think it just saves on its own, right? Okay, so I think that is going to be it for this part of the playthrough, though. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy me exploring and finding more things and... Uh, building a new base make sure to leave a thumbs up on this video It'd be greatly appreciated and uh you know if you're not subscribed make sure to hit that subscribe button all my links are down below for my twitter instagram tiktok and my twitch when i do weekly live streams over on twitch so make sure you guys go show some love uh to the other social media platforms as well and i will catch you guys in the next video take it easy